Oh my gosh, these are like one of the most amazing jeans ever. Alexis Sunshine 83, it's always sunny here. Hey Sunshiners, Alexis Sunshine 83 right here. So today's video, we are going thrifting obviously, but today I am thrifting for you again. So basically whatever I end up picking up, I am going to be giving away. I am just going to thrift anything that catches my eye that I feel like any of you would really like. I had done a video like this a couple, maybe like a month ago, I'm pretty sure. And I'm going to take a lot of the like thrift wishlist items that you all had sent on my Instagram and kind of have that in the back of my mind to hopefully find any of those today. And so yeah, it's just going to be a good old time. I do have a gift card from Saver, so I'm going to be using that and let's see what I can end up thrifting for you. Okay, so I think I've been in here for like 15 minutes and I haven't found anything that's like necessarily wowed me. I do have a couple of stuff in my cart um but no denim maxi skirts and no denim overalls i'm so upset when i had gone to that goodwill and found those denim overalls somebody had commented like why why didn't you get it for like then a giveaway which i was like oh my gosh that's like always number one whenever i ask for thrift wishlist items from you and so i'm so upset i didn't get them hopefully they did go to a good home but i am finding cute stuff but just like i don't know We'll see, we'll see how the rest of this thrift trip goes. <laughs> simple black dress this is really cute but I wish it didn't have like the ruching at the bottom like if it was just a normal dress I don't know I love the pattern though oh my gosh these are like one of the most amazing jeans ever and these oh my goodness this is actually kind of like that sheer lace dress thing I was talking about I have found so much stuff. I'm not gonna get all of it. I may get some stuff for myself. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. But there's just such good stuff. Let me just show you what I have in my cart. I found this floral dress, and a lot of people said that they love, like, you know, the 90s type of vibe floral dresses. And this is originally from Eddie Bauer, and it is in a medium. And it's just like. I feel like it could be like a medium large and it's made with a really stretchy fabric. Honestly, I don't know what I'm gonna get and not get yet, so I'm just gonna go through all of it. I feel bad that I really haven't filmed anything, but honestly, I I was ready to just like leave. I didn't think I was gonna find anything and then all of a sudden I accumulated a bunch of stuff. Don't know how that happened, so I kind of was going in kind of thinking that I would even like upload this video so sorry for the lack of footage but this is where most of the footage is going to be I'm pretty sure. I had to move because there was this person just like standing and staring at me for like a solid like three minutes until I finally just left in. Yeah, kind of uncomfortable, so sorry about that. Different angle, I probably will have to move around a bunch of times because it is quite busy, but I did find this also. It's originally from Urban Outfitters and it is in a medium. Like, this is so spring. This is definitely something like, I don't know if I will give it away. I think I'll just leave it because nobody really said like a coral jumpsuit. 
but it's one of those pieces where it's like I would love to have tried this on because I've never really owned anything like this and it could have been a really fun piece but I just feel like I don't know if I would honestly really like it also yeah these pod pants I forgot I was talking about them um I don't know how I feel about them like they're they're interesting but also like I don't know this dress is gonna be for one of you it's originally from believe it isn't a size 14 and I mean come on like better better okay yeah this blue like such a gorgeous gorgeous dress I picked this up for myself it's from Disney obviously it's Winnie the Pooh and so I feel like I feel like I should get it for myself because I love Winnie the Pooh this is a version from Gap and I mean it's kind of that like longer short look I don't know it may be a little bit too small or a little bit too like hugging for my preference but then we have these faded glory ones and i feel like if not for me definitely one of you it's kind of this light charcoal color i had picked up this it's originally from urban outfitters it's just this really nice magenta type of like corduroy dress and i mean not very spring but i feel like very very cute i had picked up this and i feel like it's maybe not as cute as i think it is but I'm also like, I don't know. Like I could, I feel like it could be fun. This one's a maybe. Okay, and then I found a bunch of denim, which I definitely think I will get one for one of you. I mean, this gorgeous found these as well. I then picked up these two dresses. Like, they are so cute. I mean, again, this is so spring. And also, I just really like the tiered nature of this dress. I also had seen these. They're just from Forever 21. They're just like a loose pair of like distressed jeans. Potentially for myself, I do have to measure them just for like some comfy jeans, but I already have some distressed jeans, so I don't know. These Levi's are just so interesting. Like, look at that. I picked up this skirt, but I don't know. I don't think it's as cute as I thought it was. Maybe if it was like a straight style versus like the pleated like elastic, but also I really, really love the pattern. But maybe not the fit. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna be giving these away. They have Mickey Mouse on it. Like, and I found it, I think in the blazers. Like, somebody had put their, like, go bags just in the blazers. And I found this. I picked up this skirt because I did really like the pattern. But it's just kind of, meh. Not really loving it. This skirt, I wish it didn't have the bedazzled waist. Because I feel like it would have been perfect for, like, a tiered skirt. But I feel like that's kind of, like... I mean, it's cute, it's not bad, but I just feel like it would have looked better without it. Okay, so that is everything that I have in my cart. I'm now going to probably spend the next 20 minutes going through all of them and deciding what I'm going to get and what I'm not going to get and also what I'm going to get for you. So I will see you very soon. Okay, I was trying, I was going to film me walking out of the thrift store like I normally do, but it's, uh, it's raining. I got two full bags. I think it was $140 and I used the gift cards and I still have $85 left on one of the Savers gift cards. So 100%, I will be filming a, another one. So if you end up not winning the giveaway or there's nothing that you like, don't worry. I will be doing another thrift with me giveaway type of thing. I'm gonna head home and then show you what I ended up getting. We are now back home and looking at this pile like i am still so shocked i found all this stuff because i am telling you i just really did not think the thrift trip was gonna go well i found so much stuff and so much stuff for you i am gonna keep i think two pieces i know i'm so sorry but like I really like them. Well, one of them does fit a little bit off, so I'm actually not too sure, but definitely one of them I am gonna keep. Um, but I would say um, most of these uh, I am giving away. So let's just get into it. I will be leaving the measurements for the pieces I'm gonna be giving away in the description. We are gonna start out with these jeans. I am just shocked that I don't know, the denim that day at the thrift store was just so good. And these ones are some Levi 501s. They do say that they are size 30 and they're a little bit more like a mid-rise. Again, I will leave the measurements for them, but I just thought 
The design with the leather accents was so fun, so unique. I've never seen Levi's like these. I'm usually not a like Levi's jean person, but these I was even like, wait a second. Do I want to keep these? But no, I have I've decided I've decided to be generous. Oh, those were $25, which is just insane. They are very unique, very interesting. I'm really happy I had obviously a Savers gift card. The next piece is this hot pink dress and Honestly, I am not a super lover of hot pink, but this dress made me kind of a believer in hot pink. It was $12.79, and I'm not too sure where it's originally from. It is in a medium, and you can wear it off the shoulder, you can wear it not off the shoulder, and it is just a gorgeous, gorgeous dress. Again, I'm usually not into this hot pink color, but when I had this on, I was like, oh wow, this is such a nice dress. I tried to try on all the items just to give you an idea of like what it looks like on, even if it wasn't my size, but this one did fit me really well. This piece is so hard to say goodbye to. It doesn't really like fully fit me. It's a little bit looser on me. It does say it's a size 14 and it's from the brand Believe. And I mean, just this pattern, this color, the like actual fit and silhouette of this dress is just so gorgeous. Perfect for springtime. I ended up getting it for $8.29 and it's just beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. I really actually want to find this dress in my size. If I can't, fingers crossed, I'm going to have that on my thrift wish list for spring. When I originally asked for your thrift wish list on my Instagram, I got so many people saying like floral 90s dresses. And I don't know if this is necessarily like a 90s like um, kind of vibe to it, but it's floral. And I think it does kind of remind me of 90s. It is originally from Eddie Bauer. It says it's in a medium and it was $12.79. Now it says it's a medium, but honestly, I want to say it fits a little bit more like a large it's adorable like it is made with a kind of like a not a jersey fabric but very very stretchy the colors are nice and bright very in your face it has pockets it just is the comfiest comfiest dress and this is another one that i really want to find in my size the next dress is the perfect picnic dress it is this checkered dress I love this so much. Now it does say it's in a large originally from the brand Empire. I would say it actually fit me pretty perfect. I got it for $11.49 and I just love again the silhouette of it. I love checkered perfect spring summer dress and I just hope it makes one of you so happy because this is, I'm really tempted on keeping it honestly. Now I'm gonna say I'm gonna yeah. The last dress I'm giving away, I actually originally got it to keep for myself, but after I tried it on, I still really, really loved it. And I feel like it's such a nice like puff sleeve dress, but I just didn't love it on me as much as I thought it would. And I just feel like one of you would love it more. It's originally from the brand Listiel, I'm pretty sure. It's in a small and it was $10.79. And it's this maroon puff sleeve dress. My favorite thing about it is in the back, it does have a tie. So you don't have to worry about the sleeves falling down. Down. And it just has such a fun like pattern on it. It has these flowers, some ruffles. If any of you have been wanting, I feel like finding a puff sleeve dress is very rare at the thrift store. I have weirdly found a couple recently. I don't know what's happening. Maybe everyone is like, oh, I hate puff sleeve now, which I'm happy. Please, please send it to the thrift store. On to more denim. I had thrifted these shorts originally from Faded Glory. They were $5.29 and they say that they're a size eight. They fit me pretty perfectly. They are this kind of like charcoal washed black. They fit so well, like this is my perfect fitting denim shorts. So I'm really sad that I will not be keeping them. But again, that was another wishlist item, which was just like nice denim shorts. So. I found them. Oh, talking about some good denim. Oh, I am in fact giving away these jeans. They were $12.49 and these are the perfect straight leg mom jean style jeans. They are so beautiful. Like the denim is a dream. It's originally from named Rupert Roppers. 
name droppers. Maybe it's name droppers. It does say it's in a size seven and they fit me absolutely perfect. So if you are kind of like a similar size to me, they are so gorgeous. I will say in the crotch area, it's a little, it's a little tight. I love kind of the silhouette style of where the pockets are. This whole portion is just gorgeous. The length of it is gorgeous. The fit of them is gorgeous. The color, the style. Oh, another one that's gonna be so hard to say goodbye to is this Mickey skirt short situation. Uh, it has a Mickey patch right there. It is originally from Mickey Unlimited and it says it's a size 11, 12. It definitely was quite loose on my waist. I had to wear a belt, which it does have belt loops. It was $25.99 at savers and it has literally i think i don't know if i showed it in the kind of like going through but it has mickey on the buttons and just such a rare find like i feel like all of these pieces are so random and like rare to find all at the same time the next item i'm like going back and forth if i am gonna say goodbye to them but i'm not sure because i didn't thrift them specifically for your thrift wishlist items because I just had an idea for an outfit with them and they just fit a little bit different than how I thought they were going to fit. They are the yellow plaid pants. I feel like it's such a wild card like of me purchasing these. They are from Britannia and they say they're a size nine. They fit like pretty, um, pretty just like fitted on my body. My biggest thing is the leg area is just a little bit tighter than kind of what I wanted. They're almost just a little bit too, not skinny like pants, but they kind of just are a little bit fitted on my like calves and ankle for the style that I was wanting. But I'm also like, it's not super tight. It's just not as loose as I had wanted. I feel like I may keep them for now and then if I decide eventually um, that I'm just like never wearing them, then I'll kind of give them away randomly. But I feel like I have an idea, but I'm not too sure if they're me. <laughs> and the last item I was originally gonna give away, but then I like tried them on and I was like, these are really like, again, these jeans were really hard to say goodbye to, but these, I was like, they just, I love them so much. So I am going to be keeping them for myself. They are originally from Unina. They are in a size small and they were $6.79. And they are just one of the comfiest pairs of jeans. Like they are too tight. They aren't too loose. They like are high rise. They just, are amazing. They're cropped in a perfect way. Usually like my jeans to be quite long, but these just hit at a perfect place on my ankle where then I can wear like my Doc Martens and I don't have to worry about then the jean being too long or just like fitting a little bit weird. I only own, I think two other black jeans and the other ones that I have are kind of more distressed. And so I've been wanting just kind of some like simple, easy black jeans. These are not like a super deep black, but a good black jean and I just, I love them so much. Alrighty, now for how to win one of the nine items from the giveaway is number one, you have to be subscribed. Number two, follow me on Instagram, which is alexandshine83. And then number three, just comment right down below which of the nine items you would like to win and also your Instagram username. I know not everyone has Instagram, but it just makes it so much easier to contact the winners just because YouTube has like a really bad spam problem. Like if you get any replies to your comments on this video or any of my videos that say that you've won a giveaway and to like text some number, that is not me. I will be specifically contacting the winners on Instagram. It just makes it honestly easier. The giveaway will end in one week and it is just US. And yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. I had a great time. Hopefully you had a good time. I will see you in my next video. Bye.